So Kim Kardashian West has now officially spoken out about everything that has been going on for the last two days and this is what she has to say. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. If you haven't already, click that button guys for daily and consistent content. Head over to my Instagram, subscribe to the channel and then let's get into this video. So Kim Kardashian West has now officially spoken out guys. We're gonna get straight into it. We're not wasting any time. This is exactly what she has to say. As many of you know, Kanye has bipolar disorder. Anyone who has this or has a loved one in their life who does know how incredibly complicated and painful it is to understand. I've never spoken publicly about how this has affected us at home because I am very protective of our children and Kanye's right to privacy when it comes to his health. But today, I feel like I should comment on it because of the stigma and misconception about mental health. Those that understand mental illness or even compulsive behaviour know that the family is powerless unless the member is a minor. People who are unaware or far removed from this experience can be judgmental and not understand that the individual themselves have to engage in the process of getting help no matter how hard family and friends try. I understand Kanye is a subject of critique because he is a public figure and his actions at times can cause strong opinions and emotions. He is a brilliant but complicated person who on top of the pressures of being an artist and a black man who experienced the painful loss of his mother has to deal with the pressure and isolation that is heightened by his bipolar disorder. Those who are closely with Kanye know his heart and understand his words sometimes do not align with his intentions. Living with bipolar disorder does not diminish or invalidate his dreams and his creative ideas, no matter how big or unobtainable they may feel to some. That is part of his genius and as we have all witnessed, many of his big dreams have come true. We as a society talk about giving grace to the issue of mental health as a whole. However, we should also give it to individuals who are living with it in times when they need it the most. I kindly ask that the media and public give us the compassion and empathy that is needed so that we can get through this. Thank you for those who have expressed concern for Kanye's well-being and for your understanding. With love and gratitude, Kim Kardashian West. It's now also been report reported that Kim Kardashian is, is meeting with divorce lawyers after Kanye's Twitter rant. So there is, you know, some kind of process of a divorce apparently going on here. And, you know, she has met people. But, you know, I feel like this statement was pretty good. It was very strong. It had a very calm, somber kind of tone to it. But at the same time, was very, you know, assertive. Um, she wasn't bashing Kanye. I'm glad that she took the high road on this matter. And was basically saying that, you know, he has been through a lot as a black man, the loss of his mother with bipolar disorder, he does mean well, sometimes his intentions don't align with stuff, and you know, he is trying his best, and he is a figure, so there will be, you know, critique for opinions, but you know, he wanted to, he didn't, she refrained from speaking from this because the kids are involved. Now, this is where people don't really think, and it's not just between Kanye and Kim, because we have not one, not two, but not three, but four children involved that are seeing this playing out in public. Um, you know, for that North is, clever enough to know what is going on and with Kanye even tweeting that he might not even see his children until he's 18 like it seems very erratic and it does seem quite weird some people are saying um you know not everything that Kanye was saying was not true in his tweets and that there was some truth to it regardless of it being painted as bipolar disorder but at the same time I feel like you know mental health there are a lot of misconceptions about it um most definitely especially when it comes to people of color and these it was just a, it was, I feel like it was a very good statement overall but not everybody is buying it. But at the same time, she is the wife of Kanye. She is the mother of the four children that are involved. All of these people are going to be affected. And, you know, as well as her, so she is dealing with a lot too. Let me know your thoughts are when it comes to this. She has broken her silence and speaks on Kanye West and everything going on. Subscribe to the channel and let me know your thoughts are, guys. And I'll catch you guys soon for another video. Because I did not expect to make so many videos on this matter. But this stuff just keeps... You do one video and next thing you know, you just have this massive progression report and you're doing four to five videos on it. This is, it's like we're on a whole journey with these little mini stories. But anyway, subscribe and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.